Lismore Card Club Hot Shots and the Northern Zone Series round number three. The F12s have all made their way out on track. They're all streaming down into the Keith, getting ready for a start this time. 14 laps on the board. Heat number four for these kids. As they all start to slow it down now into Wallace Hairpin and creep their way up this hill nice and steadily. I'll go through this SMSFM elbow, the right-hander, and then I'll give you a read on who's sitting on the pole and who will be starting from the front couple of rows. Timing doesn't allow me to do any more unless you're a genius, of course. So it is the number 11 from the front with 37 alongside him. That's Milo Bath off the front row with Ethan Keith alongside him. Ethan's getting a bit of a push from Jamie Newton. Jamie Newton's gonna have a little bit of a nudge into Attards. They're told to separate and slow down. Here we go, do we go? Green line racing! Yes! Oh, no we don't. I'll tell you what though, Jacob Scott just made his intentions very, very clear indeed. He is going inside. He'll let everybody go outside suicide, but he is going to dive down that inside and get as many spots as he can in through the kink. So back towards us they come. We're on radio silence here because apparently these poor old people can't hear those headphones when I talk. <laughs> well, the hearing must be really bad. <laughs> so, through the SMF elbow they come. Round back towards me. Here they come. In through the ball in a caravan's pimple they come. We're going to get a green light this time. Who will get the whole shot? Can Milo Buff hang on? What can Santin do just behind him? Santin might just take advantage here. That number 18, if he could just clear off at the start, he would be very, very pleased indeed. But around they come. Do we go green light racing? Yes, we do this time. That's a blast from Santin. Up the inside, he's got the 13. What, Luca Houghton? Got an absolute dream start in that Fleur orange helmet. Up to fourth. What a bell to start as they all come up the hill in towards the SMSF from elbow. All nice and cleanly. Round they come through the elbow. Santin, it is indeed who got the lead. Milo Baff hanging on to him. Jamie Newton just there. Right behind them it is Kaiser. Kaiser's right with them in fourth. Now we'll get a read on who's where as they come over the line for the first flying lap. They've all gone through cleanly. Over the line goes Max Gomez, hanging on to him. Down towards Wallace, they've gone. And it is Santin, Bath, Newton, Suffolk, Houghton, Thompson, Scott, Wilhelm, Gallagher, White, Keith, Barnes and Gomez. Through they all stream, watching for where the moves are coming. Where is, there's Jacob Scott. He's right behind Caden Thompson. Scott and Thompson expect them to come through this field if they can. Over the line they go. Thompson we follow. Through the kink. Santin, Bath, Newton, Suffolk, Thompson and Scott now. That's your top six. Down to Wallace they've gone. Now they're coming up the hill into the SMS FM elbow. Through they go and look at Bryce Santin. He will be trying to clear off. He will desperately want to stay away. Milo Bath hanging on to him. Milo Bath doing a good job of looking at Kaiser. Oh, Kaiser thought about it then. He tried to get through on Jamie Newton. Now he'll have another look. Kaiser Suffolk and he knows what's coming. Thompson and Scott are right on his tail now. Now it's going to be a five way for second, third, fourth, fifth and sixth. Up the hill they come. Kaiser's got to get through. Bath's holding on. Baff is driving the wheels off that number 11. Up the hill he comes. Oh, he's been taken. He's gone through. Newton's gone through. Newton gets through. But Baff's giving it back. Baff, side by side. Really gave it back then. Onto the straight they come. Kaiser Suffolk inside line. Woo side by side. Coming out of the king. That was mighty close, but Baff. Shut the door nicely. Holds on to third. Up the hill they come. First of all, it will be Santin. Through he comes. Holding on. Oh, on the grass has gone Newton. Bath clean. So 
Suffolk holding on his Kaiser, but right behind Thompson and Scott and Wilhelm's coming as well. Zane Wilhelm closing in. Through goes Wilhelm and that flashy helmet is in the 27 to the King. He is about to make it a six way. Down they go into Wallace. They're all coming together. This is going to be one huge ding dong battle. And if it keeps. Oh, Thompson! Thompson up the inside. He's gone through on Bath. Thompson's gone through. Kaiser's gone through. Now Jacob Scott might just have a look down into. He does indeed. Goes through and at odds. Jacob Scott does the same. Now they're all on it. Up they come. Will Hare will go through next. Milo Bath just hanging on for grim death. Zane Wilhelm, no, he won't want to let him go. Just behind them, Gallagher, Barnes, White and Houghton. Then it's Keith and Max Gomez. Up the hill they come, though, through the elbow. Still Newton hanging on, but Kaiser Suffolk's coming. Caden Thompson's going with him. Jacob Scott, he won't stay there. Jacob Scott's going to make a move. Feel sure of it. Down the long straightaway. Scott looks over the shoulder to see who's there. Now he's off. Oh, Jacob Scott, he pulled out of the slipstream and had no corner left to go. Had to pull it back in. Boy, oh boy, that was mighty close. Up the hill they come and look at Bray Stanton. He has cleared off. Jacob Scott is fastest on track and he's in fifth. He is really quick. Through the all stream. Don't take your eyes off these four. It is on. Stanton, Newton, Suffolk, Thompson, Scott, Bath, Wilhelm, Gallagher, Barnes, White, Houghton, Keith, Thomas. Is your order. Scott again pulls out the slim stream. Right on the entrance to the tent. He is desperate. Up the hill he comes. Can he get past Thompson? Thompson looks over the right shoulder. Twice he looks at him. He gave him a long, loving look over the right shoulder. And Scott goes over the left. Oh, what a cheeky manoeuvre. Thompson was looking right and Scott went left. What a, what a move. Round they come then. You feel Newton. He is just hanging on. These guys are all over him like a rash. Nine laps completed. Five to go. Bray Santon has had it all his own way. Dave Santon must be having more heart attacks. <laughs> Through he comes. Oh boy, oh boy. Brace away with it. Newton hanging on. Kaiser's there. Thompson's there. Scott's there. Wilhelm's there. He's gone past Bath. Bath's hanging on to Wilhelm. And then it is Gallagher coming down the hill. Behind Gallagher, it's Barnsey. Then it's Charlie White comes down the hill as they all stream through. Into Atards and onto the Lismore car centre straight away. Back with the leaders though. They're about to catch Max Gomez. He's going to get swallowed up very soon. First of all, it will be Bray Santin. So just watch with Max. Max Gomez in the 10. He has no clue what's coming. Over the line he goes into the kick, the number 10 P plater. You remember he loses those P's after this race. He is about to get a huge wake up call. The leading pack are about to look at him and go which way? Inside, outside, left side, right side. He is going to have it all to do. Through the elbow he comes. First to catch him, Bray Santin. How does Bray handle this manoeuvre? He's going to go inside. Yes, he does. Down through Atards he goes. Now the blue light is flashing. Max Gomez holds his line, but it's going to freight train coming. It's enormous. Newton, Kaiser, Scott, Thompson, Wilhelm about to close in on the number 10 of Max Gomez. Blue lights go. Now they're going to catch him. Oh, right in the elbow. This will be some kind of drama. Through goes the leader, Santin. 13 laps. Ah, oh, two gone inside. Scott gets held up. Now oh, they've all gone through. Well done to Max. Great driving. Wilhelm gets through. Boy, oh boy, that was close. Last lap board is shown. Break Santin. Holding on to the win. Down he goes. Into Wallace for the last time. And the freight train behind still is not sorted. 
Can Newton hang on? What a drive from Jamie Newton. He has had a blinder. Now they come through the elbow. Will he hang on? He's gonna, he's gonna hold on to second. But your winner, heat number four. It is the Flying 18, Bray Santin. Second, Jamie Newton. Third, Jacob Scott. Scotty got through. Ties against fourth. Thompson fifth. Wilhelm sixth. Bath seventh. Gallagher eighth. Barnsley was ninth. Charlie White comes over tenth. Eleventh was Ethan Keith. Twelfth was Luca Houghton. And we're waiting here for Maxi Gomez. Where did Max go? I've lost Max, he must have gone in early. Max he was, he finished 13th. But wow, what a race. There's Max, he goes in now. But boy, oh boy, what a race. Bray Santin gets the win. Newton second, what a drive from Jamie. Jacob Scott finally gets it done and goes third. Kaiser was fourth. Caden Thompson fifth. Rounding out the sixth was Zane Wilhelm. Milo Baffa, great drive to hold on to seventh. Gallagher eighth, Barnes ninth. White 10th, Keith 11th, Luca Houghton 12th, and Max Gomez 13th.